first one was obviously a huge hit. Why do you think that is? Why do you think people responded so much uh, to the unique tone, I guess, of the first one? I think Becky's very good at um, having a sense of what the audience wants. He does this incredible kind of maverick film with such fun and it's always with that. It's like the joy of filmmaking. He really captures the audience and takes you along. And it's a story like there wasn't around at that time. And I don't know, someone like Taryn, who's you know, so fun and charismatic, really takes you on that journey. And then you have someone like Colin and Sam. It's like a great cast telling a really fun story. And obviously the cast was such a big part of the first film. Is, is that why you think it was so important to get Colin back? in particular because I think I mean fans thought we'd seen the last of him but it's so nice to see those glasses and know that he yeah, is yeah. back I mean Colin is a true Kingsman yeah him and Mark should they, they should definitely do that professionally they're so good at it and seeing, <laughs> seeing Colin in a suit everyone needs to see that again so I mean I know we're only two films in but there's already a sense that it could be a real life Bond in the sense that it really could run run do you think that's something that could happen do you think it's a story that could keep going in the same way that Bond has uh, for all those years I think the truth is with Matthew Vaughan anything could happen so I'm waiting to hear as much as you guys. I mean, obviously, um, we're here celebrating these great young filmmakers, and you're talking about Matthew being a special filmmaker. Um, what makes someone like Matthew a, a great director? What, what, what is the essence of a good director? I don't think there's uh, one unique thing, but definitely attention to detail Matthew has, and it's that real motivation, which is what all of these young guys here have today, that real drive and ambition to make something and enjoy it. Like, it shouldn't be a chore. It's like, it's supposed to be fun. And... Uh, and all of the work that I've seen today definitely shows that. <laughs> On a slightly serious note, obviously there's always a big debate about um, particularly gender diversity and uh, mm. how many opportunities there are for women, particularly behind the camera. Mm. Um, as a young actress and someone who's uh, just starting out in the industry yourself, is that something that you're very aware of and have feelings about one way or the other? Yeah, I mean, I, I have a lot of feelings about it. The job I've just finished uh, in New York uh, is a job for Netflix, new Netflix original series, um, written uh, by Lisa Rubin, directed by Sam Taylor Johnson, produced by Liza Chasen, all of these amazing women behind it. Uh, it's me, Naomi, Lucy Boynton, like a great cast of females. So I think, you know, we're definitely making steps in the right direction. Um, and hopefully Eleanor can wave the flag for us in the future too. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey!